Good day YouTube. Um, just a quick update today. A uh, bit of a follow up on my video from the other day. Thank you so much to those people who responded and gave me some advice with the solar situation. Um, I haven't done any more at this stage but I will add a couple more par uh, panels in parallel as Adam Welsh suggested. Thanks for that Adam. Um, yeah, I'll just give you a quick look what we've got. So the sun's the sun's on the panels now. It's mid morning here. Um, there's those two panels in series. So you can see the sun is up above the tree line. Probably get a good three or four hours in this area here, and then it hits these trees, and then it goes around the back and sets over in that direction. And then I get maybe an hour on the far uh, set of two panels in series over over on the house over there. So that's the that's where I'm at with the solar situation. Just nearly tripping over this wood here. What you doing, Luce? Hey. I just sort of give you guys a, a bit of an update on my kelp life before cells here. Um, so they're charging nicely today. I haven't got any load on them. I'm finding I can only run all the charging gear every second day at the moment with the way the solar is because I'm not getting enough amps into the batteries. But you can see now the sun's on the panels, 83 watts, 4.6 being converted to um, 20 amps into the batteries. So that's great. That's much better. And the um, the weakest cell here is at 3.34. The st strongest cells are all at 3.36. So yeah, that's that's good. Now another thing I'm going to do with the kelp cells today, I'm breaking down this 48 volt pack over here, and I'm going to add them all onto the 12 volt pack in parallel so to, just to um, test out the whole whole lot all working together as a 12 volt system initially uh, eventually they will be configured in a 48 volt system but I'm going to run them for a little while together as a 12 volt system and fortunately I have another two 12 volt box here and one here that I haven't even opened yet um, so I will run those when I have the 48 volt system running I'll run these as a 12 volt 180 amp hour battery for charging the 18650s like my bank is currently doing it at the moment so yeah that's just a bit of an update, update guys um, Thanks for watching and uh, hope you're having a good day. See you later.